All right, Sadie, personal question. Jonathan, how did you know you were in love? How did you know you were in love? How'd you know you were in love? Well, if I'm candid about this question, um, in my marriage, I don't think I was in love. I think I was following programming. I I'm, don't get me wrong. I cared for my wife, and in the beginning, I I believed it was love. But what really what was happening? I was following the programming I was raised with. I was raised with after high school go to college. After college, get a job. After getting a job, meet a girl. After meeting a girl get married, after getting married, buy a house, and then start a family. That was my programming, that was my blueprint. So I was more focused on getting a wife than actually being in love. And while we had some good aspects in our relationship, I don't think we were ever fully in love with us. Um, my wife openly admitted that she wasn't really all that you know, attracted to me after we went through a divorce. So. You know, going back to the never married <laughs> question that came earlier, I'm going to say that, you know, I'm not to say that I married the wrong person because I'm grateful for the two children I had from uh, from our marriage. And, and certainly we treat each other as family to one another now. Um, I don't think I was really in love with her. I'm not saying I didn't care for her deeply. And then my most significant relationship after my marriage, I'm going to tell you, I chose a partner from a place of neediness, from an anxious attachment style, and somebody that was reminiscent of my mother in some ways. Uh, not physically looking, by the way, because my ex-girlfriend's drop dead gorgeous. Um, but I was really, I don't think I was in love there either. I don't know if I've ever experienced healthy love. I've experienced unhealthy attachment, and I've experienced the imago, which is choosing people like one of our parents, but I don't think I've ever really truly been in love. You know, one of my favorite lines in the TV show Sex in the City is when Mr. Big is asked, have you ever been in love? And he says, "Absa fucking lutely And yet maybe I haven't really been in love. And so I am holding out for something epic. I mean, Listen, to me, I'm either it's either a hell yes or it's a fuck no. And I'm looking for a hell yes kind of relationship. I'm not looking for uh, someone to be just to have a companion in my life. I'm looking for something much deeper. And this is why I actually have actually learned, you know what? I have been in love. I just realized it. I am learning to love myself. I am learning to love myself. I am finally in love with Jonathan. So Sadie, thank you so much because I did realize I have been in love and it's finally I'm loving myself. Can anyone relate to that? If you can, give me a thumbs up. If you can, say an amen. All right, we're gonna take one or two more questions. Thank you so much again, Sadie.